false negatives. I mean, so remember the materiality, the one we, part we just discussed, is related to risk and is related to your assessment of the risk. Audit risk is defined in terms of material misstatement. So the audit risk level is defined by the level of material misstatement. The higher the audit risk, the lower the materiality level assessed by the auditor. And auditors must have, you have to accept some level of risk. No, no firm is without risk, but the question is what level is acceptable. And risk exists, so the question is, well, what do you, well, how do you address these uh, risks and how is the company addressing these risks and what can you suggest to the firm to address these risks? And proper risk response is part of addressing and achieving a high quality audit. So the firm may not, it may not be 100% successful, but if they're showing that they're making a great effort and they're actually, it's just a matter of time before the risks become in total, uh, totally uh, successful, then, then perhaps then the, they would get a better quality audit. An audit risk is evaluated in terms of 